everyone, my name is Cooper, Product Manager of Adventech Wise Marketplace. It's my pleasure to be once again here introducing Adventech Variable Industrial Apps for you. Today, we will uh, be looking into the most popular apps in Wise Marketplace. Welcome our Customer Success Manager, Charlie, to join us today. Hi, Charlie. Uh, hi, Cooper. Hello, everyone. Our topic today is WisePass IoT Suite. This one-stop IoT development uh, kit and uh, cloud-native IoT platform. Recently, we have heard that WisePass IoT Suite has been widely adopted by lots of Devantex uh, uh, cloud solutions and uh, widely used in lots of uh, in industries. As you can see in this page, ranging from smart factory, smart building, energy, retail, and even to intelligent healthcare. Could you tell us the secret behind the success of this service? Okay, yes. IoT Suite is the key to the development from edge devices to the cloud world. Advantech has developed a SCADA, EdgeLink, and DeviceOn, this kind of powerful software to collect the data from various edge devices. Above this, how could we connect the software to the cloud? We develop IoT Suite. Then, how do applications of IoT Suite work? Through the Data Hub, data can be properly stored on the cloud and be easily accessed by cloud apps. Through Dashboard and SaaS Composer, visualizations of data can be fulfilled. Through notification, real-time monitoring won't be the problem anymore. Mm. Therefore, the connection between edge devices and cloud solutions in various industries can be achieved. Advantech also welcomes powerful solution providers and system integrators to cooperate, cooperate with us by using this IoT Suite. There are three major advantages of IoT Suite. First, this is the local service, so it's easy to use. Second, uh, it's the cloud native service, so it can be fast deployed, tested, and implemented. Last but not least, IoT Suite, this cloud native service is built with Kubernetes, which can be deployed on private cloud and on lots of famous public cloud, mm -hmm. including Amazon AWS, Microsoft Azure, and Alibaba. If customers have their own cloud space, IoT Suite can be adapted to that space as well. Wow, that sounds really fantastic. So now uh, we all know this service is so powerful, but is it difficult to get started? Mm. Uh, to get started, there are only three easy steps. Step one, connect to the edge devices through WebS SCADA, Edge Link, or Device On. Step two, collect data through the Data Hub Step 3. Fulfill the visualization. Uh, it's low coding process for all of these three steps, only configuration, drag, and drop. Um, about the first step, our Advantex Edge software provides the most powerful ability to connect uh, to hundreds of device uh, drivers and all major PLCs and controllers. So IoT Suite is the service that stands on the shoulder of such giants. Mm. About the second step, IoT Suite adopts a stronger DB service and provides the smoothest experience of data access. There is also multi-tenancy mechanism for system integrators to manage their own customers easily. About the third step, both 2D and 3D dashboard have been adopted by hundreds of customers around the world in multiple industries. Without a doubt, visualization is one of our proudest functions of IoT Suite. In this page, both of these wise parts smart factory and smart building solution suites have adopted IoT Suite as the connector between edge and cloud. And these two solutions have been widely used around the world. If any listeners feels interested in IoT Suite and these solutions, just feel free to contact Advantech. 
Let's co-create the future of the IoT world. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much once again. Thank you, Charlie. Thank you, Cooper. Thank you, everyone. As a second part of talk show, let's welcome our factory solution iFactory product manager Wei and our IIoT industrial IoT department software product manager Jack. Hi, Wei Hi, Jack. Hello, Cooper. Hello, Cooper. Willy, could you tell us how Advantech helps customers move toward Industrial 4.0 and what other solutions Advantech currently offering? Yeah, okay. In order to build up and assist our customer toward Industry 4.0, Advantech has been deeply involved in the field of smart manufacturing for a long time and committed to establish smart manufacturing solution-ready packages for our customers. Mm. Advantage factory overall equipment effectiveness and visualization solution, or we often call it smart manufacturing suite, includes a three-tier provision of service for cloud, edge, and gateways, providing our customers with an overall solution from the ground to the cloud. We offer a smart manufacturing suite in the public cloud, private cloud, and edge layer. All of them are embedded with applications of OEE, overall equipment effectiveness, EHS, environmental health and safety, and EAN event alarm and notification to realize proactive prevention, immediate management, and review afterward for maximizing competitive operational excellence. What are the key features of these three applications? Can you explain to us about more details? Okay. The main purpose of the OEE application is to improve equipment efficiency. Since OEE KPI is contributed by three factors, availability, performance, and quality, our OEE application software has a dashboard tailored to highlight the attributes that are causing lower scores under each factor. OEE application allows users to set up math equations such as machine availability and other factors with easy configuration tools. Users can configure the OEE KPI in the application backstage, and they will be displayed on the dashboard to better check and improve availability and productivity. Mm. Our EHS application checks the energy consumption of the whole plant in real time and identifies an anomalous power consumption with warning alarms to reduce energy costs and improving energy efficiency. EHS application provides an energy consumption overview dashboard of the plant for users to monitor live energy consumptions and cumulative consumption value of any given month. The dashboard also shows consumption comparison with historical data so users can monitor short-term trends or identify long-term trends. We also understand that splitting energy costs amongst departments can be a quite hassle. That's why EHS comes with a useful tools allowing users to determine the desired energy splitting method. Just like the OEE application, EHS can configure KPIs in the application backstage to better check and reduce energy demands and consumption. Finally, the EAN application event alarm notifications can monitor machine status and trigger alarm notifications according to warning conditions. This application reduces the lost cost by abnormal events and prevents production capacity bottlenecks. Advantech Small Manufacturing Suite minimizes the entry barriers of digital transformation with rapid implementation and value-added applications. Our goal is to help industry move towards small manufacturing together. Wow, that's more clear to me. Thank you, Wally. Welcome. As I know, Jack is responsible for a very promising domain. So Jack, regarding to energy and the environment domain, which is E and E. I believe that the equipment or facilities are scattered over the field. In order to make management sufficient and much easier, I believe E and E has a solution tool that can accelerate the site setup to make it happen. Could you please tell us uh, what the solution tool is and the benefits? Thank you, Cooper. The product we offer is called Device on BI. 
It is a cloud-based facilities operation and maintenance system that helps us to co let customers set up a centralized monitoring system with an intuitive user-friendly interface. We know that people are talking about uploading data to the cloud and make observations. However, customers eventually realize that getting things displayed correctly or even make a lot of modifications over the cloud service is not as easy as it looks. It takes loads of knowledge and computer science engineering to make it happen. Device on BI is the solution that covers all this. The customer just has to configure the connections and drag and drop the focusing figures and it is done. Device on BI uses the concept of virtual objects. We need to highlight this because the virtual objects is the actual thing we, are the, we care the most in terms of O&M business. The object is formed by the actual important sensor tags grouped together and provide a name, a name that the customer is familiar with. This is important because by using these names, it is more re readable and understandable to customers and furthermore, data ex exchange with other systems can use this named data in a meaningful way to make further calculations or data analysis. Okay, this sounds wonderful, but it seems a little bit complicated to our audience. So could you provide a quick and simple example of what it looked like in device on BI and how is it associated to make distributed facilitated power monitoring? Sure. Remember in the previous slides that we can group the collected data to a readable object. The hierarchical organization design in device on BI can create the virtual object in respective organization groups. In each organization, the management and engineering setup perspective is different. In engineering setup, locations of the connected device and authentications to access device lies in the configuration portal. And for operation management perspective, trend or valuable information is essential for real-time monitoring and overview. To accomplish all this, by the aid of using dashboard wizard in the same organization hierarchy, I just need to select the panel and associate the parameters I want to monitor, and I'm done with editing the dashboard. This is what it will look like after I finish dragging and drop the parameters of the chiller object to the dashboard together with detailed vibration sensor information associated with the chiller object. In this example, I need to monitor the power and the overall status of a chiller unit so I created the chiller unit object in the organization group using parameters that can re represent this chiller. For example, I have the model, the pump, the power, water pressure, vibration status of the unit, and etc. for the chiller unit object. In addition, by editing the menu of the dashboards in the command center menu management interface, customers just need to select the dashboard link and give the site name to finish composing the command center. If one of the parameters in this chiller unit requires an alarm trigger, I can give it a certain threshold to make alarms. Various alarm types and, virtual and rules can also be modified in the device on BI portal. When the alarm has been triggered, the alarm text can also be modified in a way that is much more understandable to the recipients by composing the alarm text with other variables in the same message content, helping the customer to understand the issue and shorten the reaction time. Okay, it is remarkable that within a short time, we can set up the monitoring environment so easily. Could you please tell us how and where we can get to access Device on BI? Okay, Device on BI comes with two major offerings. The lightweight version is operated by Advantech. The customer just need to go to Wise Marketplace and search for Device on BI to get started. You can use a low wise point monthly subscription to get access to device on BI with totally 2000 parameter objects and we will keep the data for you for two years. The customer does not have to concern about any infrastructure details for all the, over the cloud. Simply activate device on BI by the code purchased and follow the screen instructions and you are all done. We also provide upgrade license code for every thousand parameters if the initial quota is not enough. On the other hand, if you need to uh, use the on-premise edge cloud version of device on BI, you can contact with your sales representative. The edge cloud version has the features and functions aligned with the cloud version running on WisePath IoT suite under your own network. 
For further details and functions, please feel free to contact me as shown. Well, it sounds efficient. Hope we can make our environment greener and better. Thank you again, Jack. Thank you. Hi, Grace. Hi, Cooper. Hi, Jackson. Hi, Cooper. So, Grace, uh, your topic is quite interesting. Intelligent retail with based security solutions. Uh, is this topic related to pandemic and also only also for retail? Well, yes and no. It's not just focused on the pandemic. But because right now it's a new new normal to us. So when I mentioned the topic today, space security, many of you may think it's CCTV or surveillance system related. But I just want to let you know that if some of you already have this kind of system, Advanced Tech, we can help you to do minor integration up level to the topic about space security, including the three solutions that I'm going to introduce later on, such as the occupancy control in a shopping mall in a specific space. Second one will be the infection prevention, such as the thermal uh, camera system to detect the body temperature. The third one is very specific for the retail industry. We call it the store view inspection, which also integrates with the retailer's existing CCTV. So first, I'm going to talk about the occupancy monitor with the counting and signage. We have our own counting cameras, as you can see from the UCAM uh, 130, which use the specific uh, head counting method. You can place this kind of an, uh, camera at the entrance. Or if you already have the high vision, uh, if you already have any brand like Hack Vision or Dahua's branded IP cameras, we provide the AI counting age computer, which can connect up to uh, one to three different cameras to do the counting system. And with the interactive signage, we're also able to collect those data and show on the display how many people is right now inside the shopping mall. Mm -hmm. Are you still allowed to enter this shopping mall? or we have to wait another 10 minutes or one minute. So the signage display will show please enter or a red light as a stop sign that they have mm. to wait. So this system is quite easy to implement. If you say, okay, I don't want any counting device. I don't want to purchase any counting cameras. It's very easy to use our single app which is free download on the application market. So you, you can use also manually counting by the application as well. We have some case study I want to share. One is uh, in a uh, Taiwanese shopping mall. They not just use a digital signage with the occupancy control, but we call it the three-in-one solution. They integrate their digital signage with a pushing advertisement for the seasonal campaign. And also, uh, we provide them in their indoor air quality system, so they are able to show what is the uh, CO2 index or CO index inside this wow. uh, area uh, together. The third one, of course, to show the occupancy status, all of those information on one single display. So the Ventec, we're already able to help can do this kind of integration. So for the integrators, you just need to do minor integration job for the on-site installation, that will be fine. Second one, many of you already know about the thermal screening. So we have like uh, the other like uh, in the market already running, the one to many, which can detect uh, up to 30 people, 30 faces at one time. Another one is more economic level, which are able to place at the retail shop entrance site for the one to one thermal kiosk. So what the Ventec we are offering is a complete solution, not just detecting people's face of the body temperature, but we also provide the backend system, allow the managers or users, you can track the record of a specific person if uh, they are also implement our facial recognition uh, engine as well. So uh, if you want to do a plug and play system, just use the thermal screening kiosk or the uh, thermal camera with our age box. Or if you want to add on like attendance taking, you can also do with our uh, facial recognition age box as well. So it depends on how the retailers or end users would like to do. So this kind of solution is already like a uh, we have accumulated many of the successful cases, not just in retail side, but like in uh, in the hotel, in the Japanese hotel and hospital in the United States as well, which is related to Jackson's topic too. 
The third one is uh, specifically for the retail end users. We call it the in-store view inspection. So at Ventec, we are building a cloud platform for retailers. We call it store view. Under the store view, we have different software modules. Inspection is one of them. So you may ask, what exactly is inspection doing? Uh, you have to know that in a big retail system, like a franchise system, like a chain FMB uh, restaurants or a chain uh, uh, retail shop like 7-Eleven or Family Mart, they have a certain operation process to control or manage the serving quality. So they have a lot of supervisors. One of the super one supervisor maybe need to monitor or educate 30 to 40 shops. But how do they manage to do that? We help before they use the traditional paper to do the checklist. If they are doing the sales talking right, if they are wearing the uniform properly today. So those paperwork is too, is too time consuming. So we use the single application. They don't need to purchase any hardware device. We can help them to do the on-site inspection with the uh, mobile application in their mobile phone. Or if they already have their CCTV camera, which is IP cam, any brand can do. We have our NVR and integrate together to collect the streaming video up to our cloud. And they are also able to do the remote inspection from their app. If they cannot visit the shop today, they can do the inspection remotely in their home or on the, uh, in the metro as well. So on uh, this slide, we will show the video showing how do we do with the remote inspections. So first, you can choose the uh, on-site or remote inspection. Then you have to bundle which specific CCTV camera in which area, which direct to your uh, specific uh, spe questionnaires. So for example, if, if right now they want to check at a post counter, we connect the uh, post counter uh, CCTV camera with the, the first question. Second, if the second question is about like the hallway or in the kitchen, you can bundle the uh, second camera, which directly uh, shoots the, 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 the kitchen side. So this application not only do the inspection part, but the function part is you can do the screenshot and the make the voice recording or take a video, take, uh, choose the photo from the albums. Afterwards, after you've done all the pass and fail evaluation or collecting points, you will send, confirm the report and send out. Share directly this report via the WhatsApp or Line application or the WeChat to the store managers. And for the headquarter people, they are able to use either the mobile app or the web portal to see what's going on right now. So all of this inspection happens in the same time. There is This is more like a seamless communication for the retailers. So we have uh, thousands or 2,000 more users on the StoreView Cloud platform already. So this uh, StoreView inspection, we help the retailers and chain FMB total enhance their operational efficiency. So this will be my topic today. I introduce those three solutions for the intelligent retail. Okay, and uh, are these solutions uh, like occupancy monitoring and uh, thermal screening fit to hospital sites as well? or only for retail and the hospitality? Yeah, so for the thermal screening and the occupancy control, uh, it's actually direct not only for retail, but hospital or hotel or any, like uh, even the enterprise office, office building can do. But for the store view inspection, it's more like the retail sector directly. Thank you, Grace. Thank you. Um, I think uh, the, those solutions can help us and uh, help your customer to uh, become more convenient and we can have a better life. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Jackson, I know Advantech has been deeply developed in smart healthcare for many years, and there have been many successful cases in smart worlds. Please, Jackson, uh, just introduce the overview of Advantech's smart world solution to everyone. Okay, let's take a look at the slides. Uh, Advantech's solution is simple to understand, starting from nursing station, providing uh, I, I, our basic solutions for nursing steps. Then it's time to the warm. We provide the baseline eyewear solution for patients. Our basic include a nursing control station, 
nursing dashboard, iOS nursing card, which can quickly and clearly provide the various information and useful functions. We can see uh, nursing control station has five major functions. Uh, you can do the wall measurement, data management, nursing schedule, and user defined links. And can install on a, uh, in, install on a nursing car, so nurse can do bed management and input a vital sign and a medication check, and it's very convenient for them. And for nursing dashboard, we can take it as a, as a information center in the nursing station, which has a six major functions. You can see the patient information, bed information, or statistic, statistic and treatment plan, and nursing schedule, announcement, and a just book. And uh, of course, you can receive notifications from the patients with the big screen. And the uh, nursing steps can catch the information very quick and to make a decision and response in time. And Bayside work has three solutions, Bayside information terminal, Passion Information Terminal and Bayside Paper. Uh, Bayside, I will provide the kinds of services and information for patients to enhance their satisfaction. Uh, Bayside Information Terminal is usually a 10 inch device, has six major functions. Um, it provides the patient information and satisfaction, treatment plan, medication information, vital sign, and reminder. So patients can use Bayside Information but to send a notification to the nursing control station and the nursing dashboard so that the nursing staffs can get the messages immediately. Then they can give patient precisely helps. Okay, I heard that Advantech has made new breakthroughs in the smart world solution this year. Could you please share with us about some key features? Okay, uh, the server and I world has four key features to serve your attention. It's very competitive in the market. Uh, first is a simulation. Uh, the server gen I is not the HR, it's not the his or needs, it's a hybrid system. It's a system designed for smart world, so as we can run individual and uh, we can go on a very easy and quick. And the second is flexibility. We have lots of user defined parameters like uh, patient remarks, uh, patient status, you can do the groups, and so on. You know, different division has different requirements. With this customer, with less customers don't need to do extra work or even pay extra money to the software company to do the customization, so they can save money. And the third is the extensibility. For hospitals, they may use a lot of apps or systems to run individual. We can embed this system in iWorld, so nursing steps can have a unite portal that will be very convenient for the, for them. And the last one is modularization. The server and I will provide the API to do integration. Uh, you can read or write every data and uh, you, so you can develop your own applications. Let's make our system better than the others. Okay, thank you, Jackson. Okay. And I think it's very clear and I'm excited about the uh, news and uh, those key features. Okay. So far, the talk show, we have ended up right here. And now we are going to enter to the Q&A session. We have received several questions from our listeners. Let's see. Okay, there's one question for IoT Suite. Uh, Charlie, could you show us just one uh, key point that we need to know if we would like to apply IoT Suite? Yes, please take a look at this page. First, you need to choose your deployment plan before you get started. There are three types of IoT Suite, E-Series, S-Series, and C-Series. E-Series is the private cloud version for the customers with lightweight and low-cost requirements. S-Series can be divided into two versions. First is the enterprise private cloud version with the server rig. Second is the enterprise exclusive cloud version, which is deployed on the cloud space owned by customers themselves. C series is the authentic self operated public cloud. After you choose your deployment plan, you can proceed your way to IoT success. Thank you, Charlie. I think it's very clear for our audience. Thank you. Oh, I see one question that maybe Willie really can help to answer. Mm, there are so many iFactory competitors out there. What makes your solution special? Yeah, that's a good question. Our products provide three main competitive advantages. The first one is better cost efficiency. 
Advantex iFactory solution performs data aggregation and pre-processing on the gateway layer to reduce unnecessary data uploads to the cloud space, thereby reducing the cost of the overall solution. Our flexible multi-level data structure enables data transfers and organization settings from Advantech iFactory's gateway or edge solution directly to our PIP server or public cloud without reconfiguration. The second one is higher implementation efficiency. Our mm -hmm. solution provides customers with a better user experience and lower import barrier. We developed and refined a lot of tools that allow users to quickly design customized dashboard screens to their specific requirements, saving time and effort on complicated coding. The third one is co-creation. Advantech works closely with co-creation partners, which are specialized in different domains, and provides our customers a wide range of smart manufacturing solutions, building up an ecosystem for smart manufacturing. We have one question for iHospital Jackson. Uh, what's the benefit to implement iWorld for hospital? Uh, yeah, we summarize from our clients. Uh, I work can raise about double the state time for the patients and uh, about 20% of efficiency for the system operation because I will provide the clear information so they can reduce the nursing handover time and the uh, misoperation and uh, many more. So that's it. Okay, this question goes to Jack. How does scalability work in device on BI? Okay, thank you, Cooper. Uh, this part was not mentioned in the in the, in my previous uh, slide. So uh, what we have here is the profile service. It is a function that allows customers to create dashboard or equipment object twins from the template, making scalability much faster and easier. Okay, and uh, next question is also for Jack. Are there any future plans and roadmaps you could share at this time being? Well, yes. Uh, in less than a couple of months, we will launch a simple plugin and data forwarding feature. The plugin is to let customers make API configurations that can extract data from external APIs. For example, temperature from some public weather services, or exchange or forward data to further calculations or analysis analysis in specific domains. Okay, this is for Grace. Um, may we know what kind of partners you are working with or are looking for to resale or implement these solutions to end user site? Yes, so two directions or criteria. One is uh, very retail domain focused system integrators. Those can be like post uh, ISV or the retail SI. The second part is uh, those system integrators or resale who is already taking like high vision or other CCTV branded camera, they are very knowledge based about the video surveillance systems. We welcome these two type of partner to work with Advantech for reselling these kind of solutions. Okay, thank you. Thank, thank you, you, Grace. Finally, we have introduced to you for our current latest industrial apps and also try to answer your questions with information as much as possible. Due to the time limitation, we will be ending up right here. But if you still have questions, you are welcome to send us email by iiot.aintercom at advantech.com. Thanks for watching today and see you next time. Bye bye. Advantech Connect Online Partner Conference is a global virtual event where the business and the technical leaders around the ecosystem partner will dive deep into the exploring the future of the IoT world's challenge and drive a better, brighter future by cultivation of innovative ideas and to accelerate the digital transformation. In the industrial IoT track, we focus on the transformative industrial IoT the efficiency of the smart factories, AI technology deployments, smart energy and the environment management, smart machine and the intelligent city transportation, covering the industrial IoT strategy and the innovation, including the co-creation partner solution, industrial app, edge solution, edge to cloud technology, 
and much more. Imagine how successful your business can be in the industrial 4.0 era. I would like to invite you to join Adventure Connect. We are glad to have six topics to share with you how Adventure help our value customer with effective and cost-efficient embedded solution in the AIoT world. You will not only dive into the future of HAI, the market trend in 5G, but also can learn how to increase more business value through our medical solution and the reliable ruggedized solution. How Advantech can help and what solution we can offer for the new normal after pandemic. Especially in retail and logistic market is the key topics we would like to share in the event. In retail market, there will be more and more infection control, contactless solution, drive-through and curbside pickup requirement. We also have all kinds of remote connection technology powered by device on which can help you to reduce the possibility to get infection. In logistic market, we offer all kinds of solutions for the booming demand from the warehouse management for the online order massive good delivery and cold chain management due to pandemic vaccine transportation. Digital transformation has accelerated in the last couple of years, especially in the healthcare sector because of COVID-19 pandemic. Artificial intelligence, telemedicine, and medical IoT are just few of the hot topics in the healthcare digital transformation process. Come and find out all the latest information in medical technology. Join us at Adventure Connect. Connect. We will see you there.